Hi, I'm Billy, and and this is the start of a new series I'm making called Mini Tutorial. So in the series, I'll make the fastest tutorial for a problem that I can possibly make. Anyways, today's problem is how to set up a ragdoll. So I recently made a game about ragdoll and stuff. So there's a video right up here. So it's a no-brainer to make a tutorial about this. Okay, three, two, one, go. First, open your your project. Then make some sprites, square and square and circle. Okay, then make an empty object called player. Then make a bunch of child objects in it, like head. Then drag in the circle sprite, body. Then drag in the square sprite. Then duplicate the body four times. Edit each of the objects so that one is left leg, right leg, right arm, and left arm. By the, by the way, for the arms, you need to rotate it 90 degrees so that it's horizontal. And also, you can edit the objects so that it looks more nice, like making the legs or arm aligned with each other. But since I'm rushing, I don't have time for that. Anyways, after you've done all that, select all the objects from body to legs and add a sur sur box collider 2D. Then in head, add a circle to collider 2D. Now select all the objects and add a rich body 2D component. Then again, select all the objects but not the body, then add in a hinge join 2D component on each of the objects. Now when done that, Time to drag the body's rigid body 2D component onto the connected rigid body slot of each object. And disable auto, auto configure connected anchor. Now it's time to edit each object's hinge joint component one by one. First the head, let's just drag these uh, circle things here and turn on turn on this thing and edit these sliders so that it looks like mine on the screen. Now the arms, again drag this circle thingy, uh, same for the legs, uh, the, the circle thing, so that it looks like mine on screen. Oh and by the way, add a ground, cause you need ground for the stick man to stand on. Okay, test time and boom! Our boy can fall and eat them like a normal stick man. And you can just, you know, drag these arrow stuff here so that it so that you can see some interesting results. Okay, done. First video of the series is complete. Next video is about balancing the ragdoll, which is super important for active ragdoll games, so stay tuned. Uh, if you like this video, then give it a thumbs up and subscribe to not miss any more future videos. Uh, Join my Discord server and follow me on Twitter, too, if you haven't already. Uh, anyways, that's all for now. Goodbye.